What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. This morning I'm in my granddad's garage because outside is just like typical British weather. It's cold, it's wet, the GoPro stopped even though I didn't even know it was on. Um, yeah, it's cold, it's wet, it's miserable outside. Um, yeah. A few weeks ago, I rode a kicker ramp in South End with the boys and figured I'm going to build my own one. Um, last half an hour, I've been playing around with the radius and stuff, just trying to figure out the best, um, yeah, the best curve on that. Tomorrow, this ramp's going to be built. I'm going to take it to Danbury and basically see what stuff can be ridden. And I'm hoping it's like flippable and stuff because that would be sick. And then. Yeah, just, just take it around and see what we can get up to. But I'm going to cut to a time lapse now. I've got the GoPro set up and yeah, get this ramp built. So let's, uh, let's get building. Right, and just like that, the ramp is now built. I'm actually really stoked with how it looks. I'm going to call myself out for tomorrow, if I remember, because my memory is quite bad, I have to flip it third go. So, um, I mean, looking at it now, it looks good. But um, yeah, and the best thing about this ramp build, it's cost me four pound. Two pound for a box of screws, and I got a cheeky sausage baguette when getting the screws, so an extra two pounds. So yeah, it cost me four pound to build this, which I think is pretty good. So yeah, let's now go to tomorrow meet up with the boys and ride it. So yeah, third go flip. I'm gonna try and remember that. So yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Right, and just like that, we are now onto the next day and I have found the first ramp spot that I think is safest. I got the ramp out of the car and everyone was pulling funny looks at me. So um, yeah, now let's, let's do a lap on it and see if my ramp building skills are any good. It's quite steep, but um, the only problem I have got, well, not problem, but the only worry I have got is because it's short and fairly steep, the ramp wants to tip. So it's gives me doubts on that flip I said about doing third go, but um, I reckon now I'll do no hander on it and then potentially third go I'll do a backflip. But we'll see. I'll do no hander. Woo! That felt quite good. Now, now I gotta flip it. Oh, I'm kind of scared. What do you reckon, Dow? It's not something I'd do. <laughs> <laughs> You're better at small flips. I'm getting into the landing, good. Uh, oh, why did I say this to the camera? <sighs> I think I'm gonna put my gum shield in just to be safe and go for a wee first, because I'm a bit nervous. Right, gum shield's in. I think on this, for this, I think more speed is better than no speed and just pop and hope. But the ramp's definitely steep enough to do it, so let's do it. <laughs> but that actually was actually, sorry, that was actually, actually, that was quite easy, actually. Like, my biggest concern was because the, you put a lot of pressure at the top of the ramp, I thought it was just gonna top over and that was gonna make the spin slow down I stall out, but it actually worked really good. Did you see, Dan, did the ramp lift up? Uh, it didn't. It did. no. no, I didn't think it did. It did, but the whole thing felt spot on. I think now, um, tail whip? Tail whip or free? Yeah, I'll do a tower whip, I'll do a tower whip, and yeah. Massive shout out to Dan, by the way, because it's absolutely freezing, and he's making me feel cold that how he looks. <laughs> now, so I'd say tower whip. Tower whip. I was saying free, because it is quite windy, so. Tower whip three, tower whip three. Flip a coin. Three. <laughs> I actually love this sort of riding because you don't have to do the most insane tricks, but doing like these threes and back flips, because it's like not sketchy, but sketchy. It's that same buzz, which is what I love. Um, right, so I've done a three. The three was a little bit 
a little bit sketch, but it's all right. Um, tower whip now, right? Yep. I actually, when we move this ramp, which haven't quite thought where we're going to move it, I actually want to see you ride it down and do something cool on it. That was like a nervous laugh. I don't think Dan wants to do it. <laughs> yeah, so I messaged the boys this morning going, I've built a ramp, let's go ride it. T turn, turn, out, turn up into the car park. Callum like gives me like a funky look at, bro, that's steep. I'm like, no, 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 it's fine. Ride it, it's quite steep. But it obviously helped for the backflip. Um, Darren actually transported. Darren didn't really say much, but he's quite nervous about it now, I think. But anyway, enough talking. I'll do a tail whip on it. <laughs> this is brilliant. Feels like I'm learning to do tricks again because everything's so like just about landed. Right, so we've kind of overridden this spot a little bit now with the wind not being on my side either. So I think now Danbury Common is only like two minute walk away. So I'm gonna carry the ramp into Danbury and see kind of what natural banks and stuff we can ride on. And yeah, hopefully there'll be a few people in there to send it and kill themselves on too. So yeah, let's now get in Danbury. Right, so we're now in Danbury. Um, this is the first, what looks like the best landing that I've come across. Oh, my lens is dirty. <laughs> right, so we've now come into Danbury and this is the first landing that looks suitable for what we're gonna be doing on. I think to start off with, I've jumped it once already, so I know it's fairly safe. I'm gonna flip it to uh, heat things up and then maybe like do some trucks or 3X and I don't know, let's see where it takes us. I'm actually stoked with my ramp building skills. Um, part of me wants to throw it, but that tree is like well in like eye poking level, but if I just take off, shut my eyes, what's the worst gonna happen? Um, Cause I scrubbed it, I'm quite scared, but I feel like I want to 3X it or something. Cause it's so steep, that's why I'm scrubbing it I think. But yeah, maybe I'll look back at this video and perhaps mellow the kicker out for another video and take it somewhere else perhaps. But um, oh, I can see why I scrubbed it. <laughs> Did I land quite far down? I don't know. No, you landed pretty much in the knuckle. Yeah? Yeah, I'm landing here, aren't I? That's all right. Perhaps I'll just do another three and see how it goes. Not I bad. I didn't scrub it, though, I don't think. No, a lot better. But I just got to open out now to do the X stuff in it. Yeah. 3X up? Yeah, 3X up. It's definitely there, 100%. Down there, and I'll do like a little jib, a boobla or something. I don't, know, I don't know. I don't know what it's called, but oh, foof bar, that's it. Yeah, boob because you go back, isn't it? Yeah, go down there, and I'll ride this, and then foof to bar back in. I knew it was there. Um, right, now we've done that, I think find somewhere else and to dump it. At the same time, I want to put it somewhere that's like so sketchy, but works like Canyon 2, could you imagine? The landing is that. Because the ramp's steep, you could, it'd work, but it's just terrifying looking off the end of a ramp and seeing nothing. <laughs> imagine if you overshot and just landed the whole way down. That would be instant, instant A and E trip. <laughs> yeah, let's find somewhere to put it down. So we've moved on, just making some adjustments to my landing. I think uh, do a test run. It'd be cool to know if it can on it, because how in the background. <laughs> Look, he's scared of it. I want to do a no for cannon too, but 
Not first go, because don't know how that'll pan out. But um, your landing's done. Ramps kind of in place. It'll do for the circumstances for today. Oh. Yeah, that'd be right. I've discovered that whenever I'm going to like a bike park and I'm unsure if it's good or not, I think I just bring this along because there's no jump, so you can just put this and have the session of your life. So, um, turns out I'm not going to stretch, I'm going to send a basket on it because it feels pretty safe to do so on. Any of you boys want to hit it? Nah, you're all right, mate. I don't need it earlier. They don't? <laughs> yeah, I won't look in. Well, I don't know why everyone's not so keen on my ramp, but I'm enjoying it. But can't suit for everyone, can you? So yeah, let's do a bar. Oh, I hate straight bars and I'm... Yeah, that worked good. Right, I still know if it can on it. That's definitely, definitely there. Kind of small, but I think I'll... I think I'll go with that. So I think now, like I said, I really want to do a truck on this, so... I think I'll three it and then I'll truck it. Because truck... Step down feels so sick. So uh, yeah, I'll throw it, then I'll truck it. Well, within hopefully within a few goes anyway. Definitely truck. What do you reckon? So all the all the enduro boys that have been riding past and giving me funny looks. Finally, someone sees the um, the stoke in the ramp. So. Uh, He's going to send it. Easy! That was sick! I knew it'd be fine on one of them bikes. I knew it'd be fine on one of them bikes. Alright. <laughs> that was sick. Nice one. Woo! I don't think I'd want a double truck down it though. That'd be uh, a little bit... I don't know, what's the word? A little bit keen. Oh, I'm stoked for that. Um, trying to think if there's like more places that we could take it. Um, I reckon, as you said, the landing's better for this one. I reckon yeah. you've got to try another tail whip. Tail whip? Yeah, redemption from the uh, sketchy one earlier. Sketchy one earlier. <laughs> Alright, that sounds. Have I flipped it yet? Not here. I think I'd like to flip it as well. I know it seems every spot I'm going to, I'm I flipping if it. We, if we flip it, we'll put the other lens on and I'll get further down. Okay. So if you. Let's do a tail whip then. Tail whip. With this lens. Swap lens, then I'll flip it and get. Down there. Yeah, man. Sick. Woo! 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 All right. That was much better than the last tower if I done on it. Good redemption. Yeah. It's just speed, I think. If you go too slow into it, you can't get out the lip correctly because of how steep it is. But part of me thinks make it mellower, but then the other part of me thinks just leave it how it is. Because now I'm riding it, I feel like, like used to it, so, yeah. The only other thing we can do is... Make another one and just put jumps everywhere. We can look at a two-piece ramp. What, like folding? Yeah, well, we could have a, a slightly mellower one, but have like a ramp extension on it so we can make it bigger. That could be that could be a good shot. And also somehow figure out a way of making it so the ramp doesn't tip. Keeping eye yeah. on the vlogs. Hello, mate. Yeah. Someone's rode yeah. it. Who? Uh, I don't know his name. On an enduro bike, though. Really? Down here. He loved it. Fair play. Well, he couldn't have loved it that much because he rode off. Let's say. It looked alright. Right, now. Solid. Let's switch lenses and get a flip. <laughs> right. I think on that note, I'm going to end the video there. I am so stoked that probably two hours to build a kicker and yeah four pound to build it which is the two pound for the screws and the two pound for the sausage baguette I bought at b and I'm pretty happy with that had an awesome day at Danbury riding about if you guys want to see me take this kicker anywhere else or if you enjoyed this video let me know and I'll try and think of some other places to take it but other than that thanks you guys for coming back for our video and I shall see you in the next one